We begin in Abuja, where suspended Minister of Humanitarian uh, Affairs and uh, Better Do and her predecessor, Sadia Umar Farouk, may not be leaving the country anytime soon as their travel documents are now with the Economic and Financial Crimes Commission. But I do like the former minister, Sadia Umar Farouk, will now become a regular guest for interrogators at the FCC until investigations are concluded. Uh, TVC News, Joke Adisa has more details on this. Questioning by a team of EFCC interrogators, suspended Minister of Humanitarian Affairs and Poverty Alleviation, Betaidu, was allowed to go home at about 11 p.m. on Tuesday. In line with the conditions for the administrative bill, she is to report every day to the commission. Just like the former minister, she will also be unable to travel out of the country while the investigation is ongoing. In a telephone chat, spokesman of the commission, Deli Ujewale, confirmed the EFCC has taken custody of their travel documents. TVC News also gathered that three bank executives are also being interrogated in connection with the alleged 37 billion naira fraud in the ministry. The Federal Ministry of Humanitarian Affairs and Poverty Alleviation was created to develop humanitarian policies. It is also to provide effective coordination of national and international humanitarian interventions. The outcome of the Commission's investigations will determine the faith of the accused persons as to whether or not they will have a date in court. Joke Adisa, TVC News, Abuja.